Welcome to my channel. If you like my videos, then kindly subscribe, like, and watch. Thank you. Welcome back. Problem 7.101. So the statement is a spherical pressure vessel of 750 mm outer diameter is to be fabricated from steel having an ultimate stress sigma u is equal to 400 megapascal knowing that factor of safety of 4 is desired and the gauge pressure can reach 4.25 mega 4.2 megapascal clear determine the smallest wall thickness that should be used so let's start with the given data so it is first given that this is spherical pressure vessel vessel and outer diameter is given as 0 uh, 750 millimeter which is again equal to 0 0.750 meter Thickness is not given, ultimate strength is given, sigma u is 400 megapascal layer and factor of safety which is given as 4 layer. Also the desired pressure is given as 4.2 megapascal layer and that is equal to 4.2 into 10 to the power 6 pascal layer what we have to find is we have to find the smallest wall thickness so i will write t small or t s clear so let's start with the solution so as we know that uh, factor of safety as we know that factor of safety is equal to ultimate strength divided by working stress are here it is it will be the maximum stress you can say maximum sigma max or sigma working clear and uh, also for spherical for spherical spherical uh, pressure vessel we know that pressure vessel we know that sigma 1 is equal to sigma 2 is equal to p into r divided by 2t and that will be your maximum working stress clear so let if this is equation number 1 and this is equation number 2 so you can put 2 in one there when you put two in one you factor of safety will become equal to sigma ut divided by p into r divided by 2t and that will be equal to 2t into sigma ut divided by p into r where t is thickness sigma ut is ultimate strength stress p is pressure and R is the inner radius. Now, this inner radius is equal to 1 over 2 d naught minus thickness of this plate. And 1 over 2 d naught is 0 0.750 and thickness is not available. Clear? So, from that we will get uh, one over two it will be equal to zero point three seven five minus t into is equal to r clear now you have the formula which is Factor of safety is equal to 2t sigma ut over pr. So you can put this in above formula. In this formula, you can also put the value of r. Clear? So this is the value of r. 
you can use this formula which is factor of safety is equal to 2t into sigma ut over pr implies that p into r into factor of safety will be equal to 2t into sigma ut clear so we have p value p is equal to 4.2 megapascal and in term of i will write p is equal to 420 megapascal 4.2 megapascal so 4.2 into 10 to the power 6 is the value of P and in term of R, R is equal to 0 0.375 minus T into factor of safety is, is equal to 4. So I will write into 4 is equal to 2 into T. 2 T is not available and sigma ut was 400 megapascal so 400 into 10 to the power 6 clear so from here you will get 816.80 into 10 to the power 6 into t and from left hand side you will get 6.80 zero into 10 to the power 6 6.30 into 10 to the power 6 6 so when you solve it you will get t will be equal to 7.17 7 7.71 7.71 into 10 to the power minus 3 meter or T is equal to 7.71 millimeter so this is the answer of our question again one more thing is that while calculating this equation so you have to multiply this with 0 0.375 multiply by 4 clear uh, sorry i will write it 4.2 into 10 to the power 6 multiply by 0 0.375 clear minus 4.2 into 10 to the power 6 t Here into again 4 multiply by 4 is equal to 2t into 400 into 10 to the power 6. So when you move this t term to the right side, so the value will be this one, while on right side, uh, on the left side, the value will be this one, and you can calculate the value of t which is equal to. 7.71 millimeter i hope you will find no difficulty in solving this equation thank you for watching